German vehicle maker Volkswagen has unveiled its production facility in Kenya as it strengthens its presence in emerging markets. During the inauguration of the assembly plant in the East African country, Volkswagen showcased its first locally assembled passenger vehicle, dubbed Polo Vivo. The plant is expected to produce cars for Kenya as well as the wider East African market. The new Volkswagen production here in Chika stands for great jobs, leading technologies, and strategic investment. But it is more than just a plant. This opening could be the start point of a bigger economic success story in Africa. Kenyan President Uhuru Kenyatta said the investment by the vehicle firm was in line with the government's policy to industrialize the country's economy. Today is a, is a great day for some of us because it's the beginning once again of Kenya's industrialization journey. I want to thank the VW Group for their decision to once again reinvest in Kenya. Meanwhile, the German vehicle firm has launched plans for a ride-sharing service in Rwanda as it seeks to take advantage of surging car demand in the continent. Uh, I call it an important milestone uh, because as everyone knows, we have uh, been uh, championing uh, the Made in Rwanda uh, initiative to ensure that uh, most of the goods and services that Rwandans and residents of Rwanda uh, use are made in Rwanda as a way uh, to reduce the dependence on imports but also uh, to promote exports. Volkswagen's expansion into East Africa is expected to create employment and help communities build capacity for the entire automotive sector. Thank you. Thank you.